I don't think anyone's in this room over here, so I should be able to get in here and loot it without much worry. Yeah, I can get in here. So here's one of the, you know, the rooms. Basically, they basically all look like this. Go this way. Doesn't look like there's anyone around this way, so... That's basically what it looks like, you know, out here. And there's several rooms like this and several floors. Oh, so one of the guards is up there. That's probably Morgan Pendleton up there. There's guards up there. Morgan's probably up there, or the other Pendleton is up there. I suppose we'll go down, down at this point and I'll try and take care of those guys downstairs. So, go this way. Oh, there's a guy over there. Like, outside over there. So over here was a knocked out couple of, you know, filthy swine, basically. We'll call them. Aristocrat and Curtison. This is steampunk, so, you know, we're in, like, a monarchy type of setting. Alright, that's all out of the way. Um, what's through here? Oh, I don't like that. Keep that closed. They, they aren't, you know, very attentive, but those two can see you if, they're, if you're not careful. And I've already taken out two curses I didn't need to take out. Um, so I'm going to try and avoid taking out any more. Okay, where am I supposed to go here? Is that... Um, I can go upstairs this way. Can I? Well, this just keeps going straight up, doesn't it? So... Well, I guess we'll go this way. Okay, these two are out. Is there any way out over here to go anywhere? Look at that, there is. And where's this lead to? Red, tin. I'll be honest, I don't even know where we are. I sort of took that a little bit too quickly. Oh, excellent. He... Down you go. Alright, where are we right now? We're like right on top of here, apparently. I wonder how he got up here. And there's like no door up here, so how did you get up here? Really? Not that I'm complaining that you're up here, but... Alright, there, he's down. Um, so now we're on, like, top of everything. The gold room's right over there, so... I guess we'll go around this side over here. 
Whoa. Is it possible to go this way? Be cool if it is, but it might not be. Oh, it might be. Doesn't look it though, does it? So I guess we'll try bouncing around the other side over here. See if there's a you no know, a way I can get into like the floor over there. I guess I want to avoid stairs where possible. And come way down here would work well if there is a way out over this direction. I'm not seeing one though. There's a shadow over there to the dormitories. Now, so that's panning out for me, so. Oh. Oh. Well, there we go. This is working a little bit. Well, now I'm back down here. That's stupid. Alright, well, enough of this. I'm just t wasting time. Um, steam room, gold room. We have to get up there, basically, right? So, up the stairs I have to go. The only way to do it. Good point, I use the grenade here. And I may have to kill her in a moment, but oh well. So kill a few people. So we got a couple guys over here. I know you're here. Where is Scum? Whoops. Got you now. We're not taking this one alive. Ow. Now it's wasting bullets, alright, or arrows. So let's just get over here. Let's kill these guys. Alright, well everyone's dead. Pretty much, so... Time to go kill the guy in the gold room. That's them downstairs, I think, down there, so... Come in here. Alright. Let's see to his right. So zoom. So she, or he is dead. And... I'm not really caring about corpses now at this point. I'm just killing people, so... Eh, why not? T. Take this. Go this way. I pretty much kill everyone up here on this floor. I don't really like this floor, so that's pretty much why I kill everyone. And over this way. This is where one of those guards was that came out to try and find me. They were pissed. But they didn't do too well. Get the smokes. Oh, 
Oh, cool. It could have come, out, come in for this direction. All these different places where he could come in, basically. There's where the curse was down there. So we got one of these guys. Okay, well, I'm pretty much done with one of my assassinations. And if we look over here, those guys, those two are no longer dancing because, you know, they were scared. Wait, what happened? There's gunshots and stuff. Yep, yeah, he is. Alright, now we got people basically wandering around. I don't want to be killing people at this point, so... Possible, I want to jump out a window. Alright, so, killed one. Now we want to get down to the next one. So, we go this way. So, as you see, killing them usually raises a lot of attention. Pretty much just as much as uh, you could expect. Okay, how do I get over to Steam Room? Hmm. Steam Room. It says all this way, I guess, so I have to get there somehow. And it's going to be this way, apparently. Or is there a dark vision that you're supposed to get away? Or to navigate? <laughs> Going up the stairs and down the stairs. Saw me for a bit there. Everyone's super alert at this point. Oh. All right, you're down. To steam room. I guess we have to go through those two guys down there. And that guy. Sally. Oh, wait, no, I don't. I can go this way. All right, here we go. Morgan will be in there all night. More going for us. Though we make it more. More if they didn't blow it up prostitutes. My cousin's a foreman at their mine. He says the slaves have dug half a mile down, so deep they're dying by the dozen from the outside. Okay, 
Okay, they're both down. Now all I do is kill this guy. All right. That could be interesting. Maybe a way to kill them without raising the alarm. All right. I should be able to kill him, I think, here, so just here. Yeah, as you can see, someone's saying hello of Let's Plays. Um, let's see what this does. Hey, Lord Pedalin. <laughs> An unfortunate accident. Hey, that's an achievement, too. All right, so I killed both the guys, and now I can get out of here. Return to Samuel. The best way to do it is to probably get to the VIP exit, or... Oh, wow, it doesn't show the burnt by, so it's just gone. Well, okay. That's two guys killed. That was fun. They have pouches apparently, those two. Alright, I want to get out of here, so... Let's get out of here. If he exits that way, I think the way Emily was before, so... We're just gonna keep going. The IP exits that way. So I should be in the clear. Running away. Can go in here. Uh, can't pick those up. Yeah, um, I mean, if I can take them out, I will. Because there will be a time when, you know, it's like I have to use this stuff to uh, survive, so. Let's take that. Okay, this way. This way. This way. Alright. To the VIP exit. And away we go! Alright, it's uh, loading, so... By the way, what ranged weapons inflict more damage if you hit him in the head. Use blink to move around rapidly, sign from cover to cover, kind of like what I've already been doing. Blocking is a cool part of combat, all these little things. So the lawyers believe that Emily is being held in golden combat by the corrupt and risk of Pelon brothers. The men know Lord Pelon is despised for brothers twins, and they are lord to the Tyrannical Lord Regent. Finally, at the golden combat, limit the lords, curse and moral Morgan Pelon. We already did. So, as I said before, there's Granny Rags. Hi, Granny. The Outsider. Alright, so at this point, um, there's only one thing left for me really to do. I'm going to make my way up to... You can talk to her if you want to, but she only says interesting things. Alright, there's these guys. Um, I 
you know, outrun them. Yeah, there's these guys out here now, so. We gotta watch that. They can't hear me run. They can, if they want to. Um... I want to get across to... By the way, I didn't know I'm here. Uh, let's go this way. I'll get in through the back, right? So, we'll go that way. I missed coin. Why am I missing coin? I can't be missing coin. Coin's important. Alright, I don't need to sneak around here, so that's all I missed, I guess. So this way we go. There might be another assassin um, at this point. Usually after you come back, there's like one more, maybe? Don't know where. I read a guy that says there's one. I don't know where he is, though. Could be up there. Did I not loot this place? Or is there nothing to loot? Nothing to loot. Oh. There's these things to get. That's nice. I could return to Slackjaw and see what he says, but there's no real point to it, so... Go over here and be right back. And we are now in the art dealer's apartment. I'm here just basically to open a safe. The one ruin that I want to get. I actually never got this ruin the last time when I was doing it. So part of the reason I'm replaying is also gets the achievements I never got because I couldn't get them because I wasn't killing people. All right, so here's where we want to go, Jay. And we want to look at our mission clues or... One free eight. Well, that's all we need to know. And you can just basically go one, three, eight. Grab you. There we go. Boil party invitation. Pick that up. We'll have use for that. Pick you up. Five of five runes found. Get that. And at this point, basically, I have managed to clean out everything and everything in here. That I really want to. I mean, there's probably stuff that I'm missing somewhere. All right, well, whatever. We've managed to do enough in here, so. Um, yeah, we can go this way, so one moment. All right, so we're on the third floor here. If I look out, there's guys down there and all that. We're patrolling. I can go over here. I don't see anyone out here, which is probably good. Uh, I killed a bunch of people, didn't I? Weepers. Right there, apparently. It's funny how uh, I have to go through Weepers, but Emily didn't. All oh, those Weepers. Uh, I guess I'll swim. All right, here we are. Samuel's taking us to a pub. He said there are dead people in the river. Yeah, you can talk to her. Ready to go back, Corvo? Make sure it's working, thanks. Get in. Yep, we're pretty much ready to go back. At this point, we'll see where it goes. I'll shuffle one more time.
And here we are, House of Pleasures. So I managed to kill 14 people, four civilians. Uh, no alarms were rung, and 10 dead or unconscious bodies were found. So quite a bit of chaos generated, or current total is high at least. I don't know if I generated a whole lot, but. Um, I helped Slackdraw find Crawley, robbed the art de dealer's safe, and steamed a pill to death. Um, we managed to get all the ruins, all the bone charms, all the soak with paintings, and a lot of gold. So I'm pretty content with how this turned out. Uh, we'll continue. And at this point, we're done with uh, the Golden Cat. Next, we'll be um, locating the uh, mistress of the regent. So Emily's now safe in the protective care of the loyalists. With her well-being temporarily assured, it's time to remove the Lord Virginia's reigning allies. So I'll let you off, you know, watching her boat right here. Someone's going by a docks, as you can see. Oh, I, uh, grown up business girl. I mean, you late ship. Forgive me. As you can see, someone's running off to get the, uh, people. I should concentrate on piloting this boat. Here they come. So, there's the butler. Lydia the maid. Calista the nursemaid. And they're off. You do not fail to impress. Armed with a blade, it can change the course of the Silver River. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. Blah, blah. In one night, you've done more than most men do in a lifetime. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. So. Mad genius. Down, done for now. Uh, I do believe there's going to be ruins or whatever to find soon. But for now, I'll see you guys in the next episode and we'll see where I go. Hope you enjoyed.